Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics and we're going to be looking at a deep dive into for loop and the join method. So if you're new here, thanks for joining us. This is what we do, we do micro videos. And today's video is actually a requested comment video. So let's just go ahead and get into it. So basically, uh, I think this is from the first video out there. I uh, didn't go back and rewatch it. So let's let's just put this into memory. So name is now a variable that has the string Sam attached to it. So basically what it was was the question of if I run a for loop on name and then do I believe it was dot join I then I run this and of course I'm going to still get for name for I in name look at me forgetting a variety of things so all right it was basically why didn't I get Sam jumbled out so why didn't why didn't this happen so why didn't I get Sam three times? So we're going to examine this. Now, why did I get Sam three times? So this is how I want you to think about this. This is my, because I thought this was a inadvertently a fantastic question for us to really dissect these two, um, one loop, a basically a function, and then the other, this method. So both of these work with iterables. So name is a string, correct? But it is also a iterable. And let's look at help.string.join. Return a string, which it concatenates, of the strings in the iterable. Boom, you pass it in an iterable. What am I passing in right here as I? I'm passing in one piece of the iterable. So this is why this does not work. So let's go over this again. So if I were to pass in right now, where I have, I always love the asterisk. So let's do this. And let's do double quotes to stay true to form. You can see that. Join, then I pass in name. And boom, I now have a string that it joins each. Basically, the way I want you to think about join is it jumps in between. It's the opposite of, uh, of split. So split will go through where, where you're going to insert this in between every iteration of the iterable. So now... Now on to, let's dissect the for loop. So for name, let's look at the, the length len of name, three. So this is why Sam came out three times. So I'm going to go through and each time through, sometimes, let's actually, let's, let's copy this. Copy, paste. So I want you to look at this. This I, and I think I've talked about this once before, but way deep buried in the, the innards of the channel. So this is a temporary variable, a placeholder. I can pass this literally a, a, a blank. It is just what a, the temporary. Now, am I doing anything with this temporary placeholder variable? No. Every time through, I just want you to print name. So I'm going to have, there is a length of three. Sam, S-A-M, S-A-M. S-A-M. Three characters. I have three things to iterate through. Now when I pass in, now, okay, let's go back. So before, so then I come in here. And I, oops, 
and I do my underscore, still that that is what I named my temporary variable. And I'm going to get my S, A, and M. So if I wanted to, um, here's one that is weird. So I want two times each of the, so now I get two S's, two A's, and two M's. So now let's really, let's, let's make sure we look at this join. I give it a iterable. So I have basically an instance. So it is not an iterable. So this is why this does not return this right here because there is nothing to concatenate to. It is not an iterable yet. Needs two or more to be any sort of iterable. So there we go. Fantastic question. I love these and uh, have at least one more from the break. I want to say maybe three, but um, I love these type of questions and uh, had a great meeting today. Going to be um, super excited. It's really hard for me to keep keep things quiet, but um, really working on some really, really cool stuff. But keep these awesome questions coming. Um, makes me better. And here, the most important thing is, is somebody else has had this question out there and somebody had the nerve to ask. So great, great job. Great question. Um, I love it. So thank you always for watching. Please drop any comments, questions, video requests. Make sure you watch until the end. Check these out. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for joining us today. I hope you really enjoyed today's video. And if you haven't, check out this video right here or this one right down here. And most important, make sure you're hitting this subscribe button and the notification bell. Thanks again for joining us and we hope to see you next time. Bye guys.